Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming a little grocery haul. I've done a bit of shopping today in Aldi and a little top up shop in Asda as well. And I'm gonna share with you what I've got. So first thing, I've got some bread. This is all from Aldi, some bread. Um, a pizza for the girls, they only eat value pizza. Um, some finger rolls for hot dogs later in the week. Some of these sort of like fruit yogurts. I gave these to the baby to hold in the trolley and that's what happened to those. Uh, some cream cheese for sandwiches for bean in the week. Some butter because I'm doing this eat clean thing and butter is supposed to be much better than margarine. Some organic eggs. Some strawberries. Some salad for the week. I've got this bistro style salad and some peppery rocket and um, some radishes what else we got carrots uh, pepper some fruit then we've got apples there to make apple puree avocado i'm going to make an avocado and chocolate pudding um, which i'll probably blog about if it comes out nice some ginger some nuts, I've got some whole almonds and some ground almonds. Got some lemons, some hot water and lemon. Some bananas, some clementines. Spring onions to go with salads. Some little potatoes. Some mango chunks, I'm going to make into mango puree for the baby. Some dried apricots, which again, I'm gonna make into a puree for the baby. Some passata, then quite a few tins. Got kidney beans, I'm going to make a kidney with a chilli. Chickpeas, just a couple of tins of coconut milk. Four tins of chunky chopped tomatoes. I've got this sea salt grinder, which is 89p, and ours is broken, so that was great. This is for the hubby, tuna for his lunches. Um, a couple of baby foods just because they're quite cheap in there cheesy tomato pasta start had a bit of a blogging vlogging fail in the middle of there because I ran out of battery <laughs> so swapping cameras um, right I've got some baby food because it's quite cheap and it's handy for the week some strawberries and apples pudding apples and bananas and cheesy pasta stars which just got perfect for taking out um, some sun dried tomatoes Butternut squash, some nectarines, a couple of these fruitful yogurts. These are for my mum because she likes these. Beautiful one, and I think that's an apricot one. Some hummus, some blueberries, and just a couple of toiletry things. I, just because I saw it, I haven't had this for ages. Glade shaken vat, quite like that. The way encourages me to hoover because it makes the house smell nice. And everyone needed new toothbrushes, so I've just got these toothbrushes. So that's everything from Aldi and I'll show you next what I got from Asda. Next up I went to Asda just to pick up a few of the bits that you can't really get in Aldi. Um, so here's what I bought in Asda. I got these choco hoops which are for the girls for breakfast. Um, this was reduced, it's just root vegetable mash. Um, I'm going to puree that with a bit of corn for the baby. Some corn ham, some cauliflower and broccoli florets there for the baby as well. I'm going to puree them up with some grated cheese. Some meals for him. And I've got some gluten free spaghetti, gluten free and wheat free spaghetti. Just because I'm doing this, eat clean, and I've got a spaghetti recipe, and I thought I would try the gluten free pasta. Got this big box of medjool dates, because I want to make lots of yummy recipes with those. Uh, some cider vinegar because I heard it's really good for digestion. Um, I hope this is the right one to get. It doesn't look very appetising. Apparently you can make cider, cider vinegar tea. Right, this was a bit of an impulse purchase. These gourmet vanilla flavour drops to add to coffee. That's a bit naughty but it's got naturally curing sugar so it shouldn't be too bad. Just sort of impulse buying. A few tins of Harico, is that how you say that? Beans? Um, green lentils, another tin of those beans, 
some tomato puree, two of those big jars of tomato puree, some whole milk natural yogurt, that's the full fat version, so that's for the baby, some macaroni cheese pasta bake because girls love that, some organic milk, I'm going to start drinking organic milk in this house, a few more healthy things, we've got some linseeds, I don't think that's that healthy but um, Bean likes those, peanut bar, pumpkin seeds, a couple of packets of cashew nuts, I'm going to share a few of these recipes I've been making on the blog hopefully this week if I get time, some beetroot because beetroot is the new superfood, and some flax seeds, I also got some of this, it's turmeric, is that how you say that? Because we've got some but I'm not sure how many years old it is. Some baby formula because baby has that in his cereal. Some of these Greek style yogurts with honey. Two packets of those because the hubby takes these to work to have with his breakfast. Some apple juice for jelly baby. Some almond milk because apparently that's really good for you as well. And it's really nice in hot chocolate actually. And then just a couple of sort of toiletry things. Some teething gel because we're always teething. Some little toothbrushes because he's got his first tooth. And therefore, Jelly Baby because yeah. it's an obsession with buying toothbrushes and toothpaste for young children, isn't it? And Jakey Baby's first toothpaste. I've just been filming the whole of this haul, forgetting that on my phone I can flip so I can see myself. That's really stupid, isn't it? <laughs> right, so um, lastly from Asda, I bought a few non food things just because we're doing, I'm always doing something to the house. So um, so I bought non-food related. This toy box, one of these flexi tabs, it was three pounds, that's to keep toys in the dining room for the baby. And I'm gonna redo the bathroom in black and white. So I bought this, it's probably hard for me to show you like this. It's a bath mat, black bath mat. And I always need pegs because it's so windy. So I bought some pegs. And then just a couple of black hand towels to go in my new black and white bathroom. So that's it. I'm going to share a few of my meals with you. Maybe I'll try and video me cooking some. I don't know. They'll come up in my weekly vlogs, I'm sure. But um, there we are. Hope you're having a good weekend. Enjoy. Bye.